Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. I can hear all of you. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Hi, Miss. Miss Hi Miss. Hi Miss. Hi Miss. Hi. Hi guys. How are you? I can hear you. I can hear all of you. Yeah. Good dancing. Hi. Yes. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. What about okay. you? Okay. <clears throat> Lamba. Paris. Can you hear me? Wave if you can hear me. All of you wave if you can hear me. Anyone who can hear me, just wave your hands. Wave your hands. Yes. Just wave your hands. Yes, me. Yes. How are you? Are you fine? How are you? Hi. Hi, Miss. Hi. Just wave your hand if you can hear me. Just wave your hand. Okay. Hi, guys. Can you hear me? Yes. Go ahead. Your hands, okay? Do you remember your class teacher? Mary McKay, I'm your math teacher. So how was your weekend? Just raise your hands to answer. What? Ephrata, can you hear me? If you can't hear me, just wave your hand. Okay, so how was your weekend, Ephrata? Cardinal numbers and 
cardinal numbers and ordinal numbers. Excellent. So, cardinal numbers and ordinal numbers. Barakat told us we learned about cardinal and ordinal numbers. So, what is cardinal number? Anyone? Raise your hand. What is cardinal number? Anyone? Okay. What do you say? Can you tell me what cardinal number is? Cardinal numbers used to counting the numbers. Okay, excellent. Cardinal numbers are used for what? Counting. Okay. Uh, anyone else? What, what about ordinal numbers? What ordinal numbers? Okay. Only with Jasmine. Okay, with Jasmine, can you tell me? Okay, with Jasmine. Ordinal number used to describe the to describe the number the position. Okay. Ordinal numbers are used to describe the position of the object. Please right? I can hear you. Okay. No, yes, I can hear you. If you can hear me, just wave your hand one more time. Wave your hand. Yay, nice. Nice. You can hear me. That's nice. So today we're going to start a new topic. The topic is even numbers, odd numbers, and forming number. Do you know what even number means? Anyone who can tell what an even number means. Just raise your hand. Raise your hand. Okay, Kedus. I think Kedus can tell me what even number means. Kedus? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11. Yes? Kedus, I didn't hear you. Cannot miss. I can't hear you. Just all of you, one more time. Just your hands Please, I can't hear you. If you can't hear me, just wave your hand. Wave your hand. Okay. about even numbers, odd numbers, and how to form numbers. So even numbers means numbers that can be paired together. So pairing means 
two objects. For example, if I have these two things, it is pair. Do you understand? I have these two things, right? It is pair. It, it is like this. If it is one, it's not pair. It's single. Only one thing. Pair means two things. So even numbers means numbers that can be paired. For example, the number two. Can you see this? If you can see, just wave your hands. Don't say yes. Number two. Number two can be paired. If you have two things, we can pair them, right? Number two is an even number. So number four is also an even number. And number six is also an even number. Number eight is also an even number. And number 10 is also an even number. So even numbers are numbers that can be put in pairs. Two, six, eight, ten are even numbers. So odd numbers are numbers that cannot be put in pairs. That means they cannot be paired. For example, one. Do you see this? One is an odd number. It cannot be paired. Three. Let's go to the number three. Three is an odd number. It cannot be paired. So it means odd number. Let, listen. It means if I have three things, for example, three things like this, I can I can pair this, but this one is left alone. So three is an odd number. And let's go to number five. Do you see this? Number five is also an odd number. Don't forget, number five is also an odd number. Number seven is also an odd number. And number nine is odd numbers. So I think you learn about even and odd numbers. So even numbers can be put in pairs and odd numbers cannot be put in pairs. Don't forget that. So forming number, let's say I have these two numbers. Can you see them? If you can see them, just wave your hands. If you can see this. Now, this is seven and this is nine. Can you see this? Yes, I think you can see it. So just wave your yes. hands. So look at this number if you can see it. I have two numbers. Numbers. Number nine. So I can form another number. I can form what? 97 or 79. I can form 97. 97 or 79. Forming numbers means if you have two numbers, you can make another number. Don't forget that. If you have, for example, the number seven and the number nine, you can form what? 90, 97, and 79. Don't forget that, okay? Okay, I'm gonna ask you questions. So listen carefully. Can you hear me? If you can yes. hear me, just wave. Yay, just wave. And I'm gonna ask you questions. So Miss, we can hear you. Just wave your hands. Don't talk, just wave your hand if you can hear me. Okay. Look at this number. This number is who can tell me? Raise your hand. What is this number? Three. three. What is this number? Okay, three. Ruth. Ruth. Ten. Raise your hand before your answer. Ruth, what is this number? Odd. Did you see this number? Three. Three. This number is three. Excellent, Ruth. Three. Okay. What about this number? Can Five. You hear me? Raise your hand. Five. Raise your hand, Meva. So this is five, right? So can yeah. you form a number with these two numbers? This is three and this is five. Can you form? Just raise your hand to answer. Raise your hand. Okay, Naomi. Naomi, can you form a number? Five. Right? Five. five. Okay. And what about this? Naomi? 
Sorry, I couldn't see. Excellent, excellent. So this is three, this is five. So I want you to form a number with this. Anyone who can form a number? Bemnet? 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 Can you form a number using two, these two numbers? Five and three? Can you form a number? Anyone who can form a number? Efrata? Efrata? I can't hear you. Your mic is off. Efrata? Efrata? I can. This number is three, right? Yeah, yeah. This number is five. I yeah, want you to yeah. This number with this with these two numbers. Can you tell me? Uh, okay, you added it. Okay, listen to me. Oh, okay. This number is three and this number is five, right? So when we form two numbers, it will be 75 or 53. You understand now? It will be 35 or 53. We are making three numbers. You understand? If you do, just this way we can understand. Okay. That's it. So can you Okay, with that, I can see you. With that, I can see you. So, what about this number? Eight. Eight. Can you form a number with this? Eight. Two? Can you form a number? Just raise your hand. You can form a number. Okay, Ami. Ami. Yes. So form a number using this number, six and eight. Can you form any number? Six is the eight. Another number? Excellent. Another number is can be using six and eight. You can form a number. Excellent. Excellent. I mean, so we can form 86 or 68. So don't forget, forming numbers are very easy. So anyone can tell me even numbers. What is an even number? Even number? Okay, Barakat. Can you tell me what even numbers are? Okay, if, if, even numbers are two, 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 three, two, four, six, six, eight, eight, ten. Excellent. So, even numbers are, to Baraka say, two, six, eight, and ten. So, they can be put in pairs. Don't forget. Even numbers can be put in pairs. What about odd numbers? Can you tell me about odd numbers? Odd number. Odd number. Raise your hand. Raise your Can you tell me? Okay. What about Meba? Meba, tell me. Yes, please. Okay, Meba. You can right? Okay. Odd numbers are one, three, five, seven, eight, eight, eight nine. nine. Okay. So we have said odd numbers are one, seven, eh. one, three, seven, eight, nine. We said. What about five? Is five odd number or even? Raise your hand. Ephrata? Ephrata? Odd. Five is odd number. Five cannot be put in pairs, so it is odd number. Okay, 
What about forming numbers? Can you tell me about forming numbers? How can you form a number? Raise your hand. Raise your hand to answer. Only two persons. Okay, Genesis. Genesis, answer. Luke. Okay. Um, uh, Amen, can you answer? Yes. And how are you? Can you tell me how to form a number using one digit? I showed you like, for example, let's say this is eight, right? This is six. So how can you form a number? This could be one digit. This is one digit number. This is another one digit number. Can you form any number using these two digit numbers? Can you form it? Eight and six. Can you form any number? Okay, we will be right back. Can you tell me? 86. 86. Another number? Digit Excellent. So you can form one digit number. For example, let's say this is eight, a one digit number, and six is another. Uh, this is eight, and this is six. So eight is a one digit number, six is a one digit number. When we put them together, we can get two digit number. For example, 86 and another one, 68. You have to fold like that. So I'm going to show you your notes. Okay. So, okay, please, if you have questions, just raise your hand. Please do not talk. If you don't have questions, just sit still. And if you don't hear anything, just wait, okay? Don't forget. Yes. I'm going to show you. Please, I can hear you. Please, I can hear you. Please, I can hear you. Okay. Please, I can hear you. Okay. Please, I can hear you. Okay. I can't hear you. you do. Yes, I can hear you. Okay, let's tell it. Me, I can't hear you. Okay, okay, okay. I'm a... Me, hmm? I can't hear you. Okay, I'm a... Me, I can't... So, can you hear me now? Yes. 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 Miss, I can hide. Miss, I can hear you. Just wait. I can hear you. Okay. Okay, so can you look, uh, look at this, even and on numbers? Can you see this? If you see this, just wave your hands. Just wave your hands. Okay, Meba, can you see this picture? If you can see this, just wave your hand. Okay, so listen, uh, even and odd numbers. So even numbers are numbers that can be put in pairs, are called even numbers, and a pair means two objects. Can you hear me, Meba? 
Okay, numbers that cannot be put in pairs are called odd numbers. So listen, numbers that can be put in pairs are called even numbers. A pair means two objects. I told you before, right? A pair means two things. For example, two, four, six, eight, 10, 72, 14 are even numbers. Numbers that cannot be put in pairs are called odd numbers. For example, one object is not paired. Example, one, three, five, seven, nine, eleven, and thirteen. So forming numbers. We can form numbers in different ways. We can make thirty-seven and seventy-three with three and seven. Let me show you using this number. We can form, for example, this is six, right? And this is seven. This six is one digit number. Seven is also one digit number. We can form numbers using this two. For let's say six, six and we add this seven, we get 67. We can form numbers, one digit number and another one digit number. We can make them 67. And let's say we can also get 70, 76. So let me show you a video about forming the numbers and even and old numbers. Today, let's learn even and odd numbers with Ozzy the Owl. Good morning, everybody. Let us begin our lesson today by understanding what even numbers and odd numbers are. All numbers with the digits 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8 in the ones place are called even numbers. Let us see an example. Look at the number 12. Number 12 has 2 in the ones place. So, it is an even number. Now, let us understand the meaning of odd numbers. All numbers with the digits 1, 3, 5, 7 or 9 in the ones place are called odd numbers. Look at the number 17. Number 17 has 7 in the ones place. So, it is an odd number. Now, let's try to find out some odd and even numbers from the given numbers. Look at the numbers 53, 71, 42, 34, 89. First, let us look at the number 53. Here, the number 3 is in the 1's place. So, 53 is an odd number. Next, is the number 71. Here, the number 1 is in the 1's place. So, 71 is an odd number. Now we have the number 42. Here 2 is in the 1's place. So 42 is an even number. Let us see which is the next number. Here it is 34. Here the number 4 is in the ones place. So, 34 is an even number. And the last number is 89. Here, the number 9 is in the ones place. So, 89 is an odd number. 
Well done! We have found two even numbers and three odd numbers. Now, let us look at our school calendar and see if we can identify the even and odd numbers. All numbers with the digits 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8 in the ones place are called even numbers. Hey, we have correctly identified the even numbers. Now, let us see if we can identify the odd numbers. All numbers with the digits 1, 3, 5, 7 or 9 in the ones place are called odd numbers. Yay! We have successfully identified the odd numbers as well. Hope you had fun learning about the odd and even numbers. So, so can you hear me now? Okay, if you can hear me, just wave your hands. Do you have any questions? Okay, about even and odd numbers. Do you have any questions? Anyone? Who has a question about even and odd number? I mean, do you have a question? No. Okay. If you don't have a question, let me ask you. So, what are even numbers and what are odd numbers? Who can tell me? Just raise your hand. Okay, Bamla. Bamla, can you tell me? I think your mic is off, Bamla. Okay, another one? Who can tell me? Uh, Barakat, can you tell me? What even numbers are? Barakat. Okay, even okay. number, even numbers are the even numbers are zero. Okay. Two. Okay. Four. Six. Excellent. Six. Thank you. Okay. Anyone else? Etrata, unmute your mic and tell me about odd numbers. Etrata, your mic is off. Your audio is off, Etrata. I got you. Okay. Um, anyone else about odd numbers? Raise your hand. Uh, Edus, can you tell me about odd numbers? Okay. One, three, six, okay. seven, nine, eleven. Okay, thank you, Edus. So odd numbers are one, three, seven, nine, eleven are odd numbers. So odd numbers cannot be put in pairs. So do you have any questions? All of you, do you have any question about even numbers, odd numbers, and forming a number? If you have a question, just raise your hand. You don't have a question? Okay, Faris. No. Faris, you have a question. Okay. Please, you don't talk to me. You don't what? I can't hear. Please talk louder, Faris. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you have any questions? 
Okay, Faris, I'm listening. Please, you don't have to give me chance to me. Oh, you want to answer? Okay, I'm so sorry, Faris. I didn't give you chance, right? Okay, can you tell me about even number and odd numbers, Faris? Two is four. No. It's eight. Okay. Seven. Okay. Anything else, Faris? Even numbers. Okay. What about Naho? Do you have any questions? Naho? Jonas. Do you have a question? Do you have a question, Naho? Huh? Do you have a question? Yes. Okay, can you ask? What's your question, Naho? Yes, I have a question. Okay, can you ask me? Is it about even and odd numbers? Okay, anyone else who has a question? So I hope you learn many things about uh, even and odd numbers and forming numbers. If you have a book, just raise your hand. Do you have your book? If you have a book, just raise your hand. Who has your book? Grade two maths book. This book. Look at this. Do you have this book? If you have it, I want yeah. you to. Okay. No means. Okay. If you don't have, if you have the book, I want you to do the exercises. Okay, in this book about even and odd numbers and forming numbers. I will see you next week for grade two. Look, look this book. So I will see you just like that. Raise your hand if you don't have a book. Raise your hand. Okay, tell your parents to buy this book and do the exercises. See you next week. I have bye. one book that. Okay, bye. <laughs>